Welcome back to the Iraqi Dunar News Channel. Today, we're discussing some fascinating insights shared by Intel Guru Frank 26, based on a boots on the ground report from Iraq. Our source, Firefly, has reported that Iraqi television is showcasing a significant meeting where Prime Minister Sudani announced a grant of 4 million dinars to all displaced families currently residing in camps throughout Iraq. This development brings up an intriguing point made by Frank 26. While 4 million dinars might seem like an insult at the current exchange rate of 1,320 IQD to 1 US dollar, it could be seen as a blessing if the rate were to shift to 1.32 IQD to 1 US dollar. Let's dive into what this means for Iraq and its citizens and the potential implications for the future of the dinar. First, Let's understand the current situation of the displaced families in Iraq. Displacement has been a significant issue in the country due to years of conflict, economic instability, and other challenges. These families have been living in camps, often under difficult conditions, and any financial assistance from the government is crucial for their survival and well-being. The announcement of a 4 million dinar grant is aimed at providing some relief to these displaced families. However, the value of this grant is heavily dependent on the exchange rate of the Iraqi dinar. Currently, the exchange rate stands at approximately 1,320 IQD to 1 US dollar, making 4 million dinars roughly equivalent to dollars 3,030. Given the current economic conditions and the cost of living, this amount might not be sufficient to provide significant relief to the displaced families. This is what Frank 26 refers to as an insult, highlighting the limitations of the current exchange rate and providing meaningful assistance. Now, let's consider the hypothetical scenario where the exchange rate changes to 1.3 to IQD to 1 US dollar. In this case, 4 million dinars would be equivalent to approximately 3.03 million dollars USD. This dramatic increase in value would transform the grant into a substantial financial boon for the displaced families, significantly improving their living conditions and providing them with the resources needed to rebuild their lives. This is what Frank 26 refers to as a blessing, emphasizing the potential impact of a revaluation of the dinar. The idea of revaluing the Iraqi dinar has been a topic of discussion and speculation within the dinar community for years. A revaluation would involve increasing the value of the dinar relative to other currencies, which could have significant implications for the Iraqi economy and its citizens. For the displaced families, a revaluation could mean a substantial increase in the value of the grants and other financial assistance they receive from the government. Such a revaluation would also have broader implications for the Iraqi economy. It could lead to increased purchasing power for Iraqi citizens making goods and services more affordable. It could also attract foreign investment, as a stronger dinar would signal a more stable and robust economy. This, in turn, could lead to job creation, infrastructural development, and overall economic growth. However, revaluing a currency is a complex process that involves various economic, political, and financial considerations. It requires careful planning and execution by the central bank and the government to ensure that the transition is smooth and does not lead to unintended consequences, such as inflation or economic instability. The government would need to implement policies to support the revaluation, such as controlling inflation, stabilizing the economy, and ensuring that the banking system is robust enough to handle the changes. The announcement of the 4 million dinar grant also highlights the government's efforts to address the needs of displaced families and provide them with the support they need. It shows a commitment to improving the living conditions of vulnerable populations and addressing the social and economic challenges they face. This is a positive step towards rebuilding the country and ensuring that all citizens have access to basic necessities and opportunities for a better future. It's important to note that while the potential revaluation of the dinar is an exciting prospect, it is still speculative at this point. There are no official announcements or concrete plans from the government or the central bank regarding a revaluation. Therefore, 
While it's important to stay informed and hopeful, it's also crucial to approach these discussions with a level of caution and realism. For those closely following the developments in Iraq, it's essential to keep an eye on official announcements and policy changes that could signal a move towards revaluation. Monitoring economic indicators such as inflation rates, foreign investment levels, and overall economic stability can provide insights into the likelihood of a revaluation occurring. Engaging with credible sources and experts who can provide informed analysis and perspectives is also important. In conclusion, the announcement of the 4 million dinar grant to displaced families in Iraq is a significant development that highlights the current economic challenges and the potential impact of a revaluation of the dinar. While the grant might seem insufficient at the current exchange rate, it could transform into a substantial financial boon if the dinar were to be revalued. This underscores the importance of monetary policy and exchange rates in determining the value of financial assistance and its impact on citizens' lives. As we continue to follow the developments in Iraq, it's crucial to stay informed, engage with credible sources, and approach the discussions with a level of caution and realism. The potential revaluation of the dinar is an exciting prospect but it requires careful planning and execution by the government and the central bank. In the meantime, the focus should remain on supporting the displaced families and addressing the social and economic challenges they face. Thank you for tuning into today's video. If you found this analysis insightful, please like, share, and subscribe to the Iraqi Dinar RV channel for more updates and in-depth discussions. Leave your thoughts and questions in the comments below we love hearing from our community. Until next time, stay tuned and stay informed.